Hello everyone. In this video, we will learn about reader writer problem as well as reader writer problem using semaphore. So let us start with the reader writer problem. So first of all, what is reader writer problem? In this problem, all the process are either accessing your database in reading mode or in writing mode. Or we can say processes are wishing to perform reading operation or writing operation on your database now what actually the reader writer problem is it is acceptable to have multiple processes reading the database at the same time means we can allow more than one process to access our database in reading mode but if one process is updating or writing the database then no other process is allowed to access your database not even in reading mode let us take example suppose we are having three process p1 p2 p3 and all these three process are accessing the same database now this process p1 is suppose writing or this process p1 is performing writing operation on this database same time this process p2 wants to read this database then will it allow no because this process p1 is writing into this database same way process p2 wants to write operation on the same database then it's not allowed same way process p3 wants to read operation then again it is not allowed same way process p3 wants to perform write operation then again it is not allowed means out of these three process if the first process is performing the write operation on this database then at the same time these two process is not allowed to access this database not even in reading mode now suppose process p1 is accessing your database in reading mode means process p1 is reading data from this database the same time process p2 wants to perform read operation on the same database will it allow yes we can allow but if the process p2 wants to write operation on the same database then will it allow no we cannot allow write operation on this database now at the same time process p3 wants to read operation it's allowed but if process p3 wants to perform write operation then it is not allowed so we conclude that we can allow more than one process to access our database in reading mode so here all these three processes can access the database in reading mode but in such case we need to keep the track of number of processes that are reading our database that is nothing but a reader count means this reader count is having the value a number of process that are accessing our database in reading mode so right now there are three process that are accessing our database in reading mode so the value of reader count is three so this is reader writer problem now next move further reader writer problem using semaphore so here we are executing our algorithm of reader writer problem using semaphore now next move further the algorithm first one is type def int semaphore here we are declaring a special variable that is semaphore variable then after semaphore mutex equals to 1 here this variable mutex is used to control the access to reader count we have already seen what is reader count that keeps the track of number of processes that are accessing our database in reading mode so this mutex variable is used to control the access to act that reader count variable and after semaphore db is equal to 1 again this variable is used to control the access to our database then after integer reader underscore count equals to 0 here we are declaring a variable that is reader underscore count having the number of processes that are reading the database then after void reader in bracket void this function is to be called by process whenever that process wants to access your database in reading mode then after while true while your process wants to read data from your database this condition becomes true then after 
down and person mutex here the process is gaining the access to reader count process wants to access your database in reading mode that's why this process must have to take access to reader count because once this process will start to access your database the number of process that are reading your database reading port is increased by one that's why here this process this process is gaining the access to reader count now reader underscore count is equal to reader underscore count plus one once your process starts to access your database in reading mode the number of process that are reading your database in reading mode is increased by one so here we are increasing the value of reader count now if reader underscore count double equals to one means if this is the first process to access your database in reading mode then this condition becomes two then here this process will down end person db means this process will simply prevent the writer process to access your database that's why here this process will simply down the value of db variable then after up end person mutex here the value of mutex is increased by one because it allow another process to access your reader underscore count means some other process wants to access your database in reading mode then that process will access your reader count variable so to allow that process to access your reader count here the mutex is to be increased or up by this process then after read underscore database this process is reading your database then after down end person mutex again now this process has finished its reading operation now this process wants to exit from critical section so this process again wants to decrease the value of reader counter so to access the reader count variable again this process need to access the gain this reader count so again here down and person mutex now reader count is equal to reader count minus one so once the process is exited from critical section the number of process that are reading the database in reading mode is decreased because one process is already finished its work so here the reader count is decreased by one now if reader underscore count double equals to zero this condition becomes true whenever it is the last process means if this process is last to read your database then this condition becomes true if this condition becomes true then whatever the value of db is down that is up over here so that another process can access this database in writing mode then after up and person mutex here this will allow the other process to access the reader underscore count then after whatever the value that is read over here that is used by this process here the while is over here the while condition is over and function is over so this function is called by a process whenever a process wants to access your database in reading mode next one is void writer void this function is called by writer whenever a process wants to access your database in writing mode so while condition becomes true create underscore data here it will create data to enter into your database that is in non critical section now once the data is created it will down the db so that another process cannot access your database so here this process has gained the access to database now whatever the data that is created in non critical section is to be returned over database so here write underscore db so write information into your database of n person db once the write operation is finished the db is up by this process so that another process can access this database in writing mode so in this way reader writer problem using semaphore is executed thank you very much